Um, a lot of people think they actually know me, but they don't. But today I'm here to explain to you how it was for me. I was like a very bad kid. Um, I caused a lot of disruptions in school. Um, and as I got older, I, the streets raised me. I graduated from each school. Um, I graduated from Vox, over to Strawberry Mansion, and then I went to Bieber. When I went to Bieber, I, like I told you, I didn't like Winfield at all, but I went to Bieber and it was, I got a cultural shock because there were white kids around 15. I would just hang out with some of the guys that lived around Burke Street and we would drink wine. Um, you know, I would drink wine and I would still work at the stores. My father had a store on the 54th and birth. So they took me in the basement and they rolled up my sleeves. Now, at this time, I knew nothing about drugs. Um, all I was relying on is that my friends, what I thought when my friends was telling me I would forget about my pain about the game. Um, at the, the first drug was heroin. They injected heroin into me and I just kept telling them to pull it out, pull it out, but they never did. <clears throat> um, immediately after I threw up ungodly, mm -hmm. I just threw up big gobs of, and I say maybe a half an hour later, I just felt this calmness about me, mm. right? And I think for the next 17 years, my whole life surrounded getting, using, and trying to find that feeling again. At that point, I got a, a degree in human services. And what type of degree was that? Uh, it was associate degree. Associate degree. I transferred into Temple University. Wow. And um, I was trying to get a bachelor's in social work. I struggled through that. I finally got through, and I got my bachelor's in social work. Wow. Um, I went to the St. Joe's, and I got my master's degree from St. Joe's in 2003. Wow, and that's in criminal justice? In criminal justice. I know for sure that God has kept me here because he has a purpose for me. Is, do you, is Jesus Christ your higher power? Jesus Christ is my higher power. 